Hey guys! Hey everybody, it's me, Zach, and this is Judy. <laughs> and we are back to do another Amber Lynn Reed reaction. Now listen, I have two earrings on because I'm kind of quirky and edgy. And sometimes I just like to like put it on and see like which one's gonna go with my outfit better. <laughs> so I did miss out on reacting to yesterday's Vlogmas, which was Vlogmas Day 16. I think essentially all I missed was Becky proving that she should not be driving Amber Lynn places. We're actually about to go to the store. I will say I'm very proud of myself because last time I went grocery shopping was a week ago. So, woo woo. Actually, I think it was seven days ago because it was last Monday, to, Monday, today's Sunday. But I've been going like a lot lately and it's like, I need a, oh, dear my father. Sorry. Ooh, that girl's big mad. Did you not see her, babe? Yeah, no, I didn't. She was flying by right there. Dang. So, um, what was I saying? <laughs> Yikes. And Amber Lynn flexing her giving, giving Lynn life, whatever. Good for her. Good for the shelter that's going to benefit from that work. We love to see it, I guess. Yes, wonderful. So today I want to just jump back in with another Vlogmas React and I will also say that if you didn't see, I broke my, my MacBook and that's why I like took a little bit of time away. It's only been like two days. It's really okay. If you didn't know that, I talked about it on the community tab and on all of my social media. So make sure to follow me there and you'll always get an update about what's going on with my life. Let's jump in. Hey guys. So... Welcome to Vlogmas Day 17. It's hard to believe that when you guys are watching this, because today's, today's the 16th, when you guys are watching this on the 17th, I'll be 29 in 10 days. Yes, you made it to 29. Happy birthday, Amberlynn. <laughs> Normally I joke about birthdays because I'm like, literally all it means is that you made it one more year. 365 more days <laughs> around around the, the globe, around the sun is what I meant to say. I'm not a scientist, but that is how it works. You made it another year around the sun and I'm, I'm proud of you. Way to go, girl. Unbelievable. So that means I'm gonna be 30 in a year and 10 days. Listen. Wow. So, no, don't be sad. 30 is great. I'm 30, I'm flirty, I'm thriving. We love to see it. So far today, um, typical routine, woke up, weighed myself, showered, got ready. Hello. I've also been Hi. with friends on Marco Polo. So it's just been a pretty low key morning. That's literally my typical morning um, right there. A lot of people are like, you should do a morning routine. <laughs> it's boring. So next thing. What are most of your videos? What are most of your videos for 500 Alex? <laughs> Mostly boring. On the list is I have a mess over there that I want to clean. I don't want to clear off a bookshelf because Becky actually wants to put her movies on there. You you better make a place for Becky. She deserves it after she's driving you around while she's comatose. Come on. I'm gonna go clean up that mess. All right. And I will catch up with you guys. All right. We. Just a friend. Hey. Ooh. She knows this is my favorite. So, y'all, she she is putting in this music for me. I love you, Amberlynn. Thank you so much. I love a dance. We love that moment. Next thing I'm gonna do now that all this is cleared. I'm gonna go through all this. I don't need this many chokers. <laughs> Surely and don't. And I what? I have a bunch of stud earrings in here. Ooh, okay, some of those are cute. Let me get some of those. If you're if you're giving them away, I'm ready. I still wear, just on oh. so I'm gonna go through those. 
just go through all this and get rid of some. Okay. So I know to you guys, this is still a lot, but for me- I was like, girl, what did you exactly get rid of? <laughs> what? I got rid of a lot and I also got rid of a lot- Where? Of earrings, which I'll show you guys the box um, here in a second. I, I do this- Don't believe it. I'll go through my, maybe even twice. I'll go through all of my jewelry. So yeah. Um, I feel like I've done really good. I that. haven't even seen her wear most of those chokers that are hanging there. Like, I don't know that I've ever seen her wear some of them. Why are you keeping those? This box is pretty big. And I got rid of a ton. The lighting in here is bad. Hold on. So, just tons of jewelry. So right now, Can you imagine? these are the boxes I'm either donating or letting my friends go Can through. Can you imagine? Can you imagine being her friend scavenging through her stuff <laughs> for her used goods? Woo, but listen, I will take some of those stud earrings. Some of those are cute. I'll take them. No shame. I'm getting rid of a lot. So if you guys haven't gotten Disney Plus, you need it in your life. Absolutely. It's so nostalgic. But Becky and I love Anna Kendrick. And there's a Christmas movie. There is. We also love Christmas movies. There is. And we've seen majority. So there's one with Anna in it. Look. Yeah, okay, I'm great. I'm so excited right now. Wow. Watch it. Stand it. So we watched about half of the movie. Um, my attention span is super short. You are. You guys, look at this weather right now. She's so dumb. This is so fake. I hate it. It's fake. You're faking. You're trying to be funny and you're not. <laughs> Okay, it doesn't look as dark. On you're, camera, you're trying to make a bunny. Holy crap, you guys. I'm not feeling well at all. My stomach hurts really bad when storms start happening. And what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what? Listen, storms do affect some things. Like, I know folks who get migraines, right? Migraines from when a storm rolls in or, like, their sinuses start acting funny. But your stomach? All right, Dr. Lynn Medicine Woman, tell, tell me more about this diagnosis because I got a lot of questions. As I speak, the rain gets harder. I don't know. Like, I love the rain minus the storms. Like, if it was just raining without thunder, lightning, you know, the horrible wind, I'd be toast down with it. Would you? Would your stomach hurt? Would your stomach hurt? Because that's what I'm trying to learn more about right now. Um, because I love rain, but with the mixture of everything else, and like I'm afraid of tornadoes. Like I feel like one's gonna come and like blow us away. Oh, let's take a peek. See, I mean, it's nowhere near as bad as it was like two seconds ago. Let's be real. All right. I'm ready. When I was in my bedroom. Show me. Actually 15 minutes ago. This door, I'm gonna be real chill. It's no boy now. Oh, there we go. Chill. I mean, it's not too bad right now. Like this is mainly, it just seems like peaceful rain, but then lightning and thunder. Wait, I, I need you to clarify. It's the, the storming rain that makes your stomach upset? I, okay. And these horrible wind gusts will randomly happen. And my stomach just hurts so bad from it. Is it stomach hurting from like anxiety? Am I just not understanding? Is that what she's trying to say? Am I dumb? Am I stu Is this something that happens and I just never knew about it? So I'm sure you guys remember when I bought this Gucci bamboo set. I don't. Where you buy so much dumb shit, I, I can't remember, to be quite honest with you. It came with the perfume. <gasps> yeah, Becky just chilling in the back. I was just gonna say, look at Becky back there just <laughs> hanging out, poor girl. Um, it came with the perfume. It came with this little rolly on, which I'm actually gonna um, put in my purse. Is, is that the scientific name? The little rolly on? <laughs> That's my favorite type of perfume, the kind that, that you can rolly on. And then it came with the lotion. So love the perfume and stuff, but I remember like, cause when I showed you guys, I remember when I said that I smelled the lotion. You smelt it? The container. You smelt it. The lotion, and I was like really shocked by it. And I was like, okay. <coughs> 
just because I thought it wasn't gonna like have a really strong scent and I get nervous trying new like lotions and stuff, I didn't try it and I've been wanting to try it and I finally did. And you guys. What kind of, <laughs> it's lotion. What do you mean you've been meaning to try it? Just use it, just use it. This is something you have to plan for months to do. <laughs> it's lotion. Once it's out of the bottle, it smells like literal heaven decided to just like fall on your hands or like maybe you washed your hands in like heaven water. I don't know. What do you <laughs> heaven <think>? water. <laughs> she loved it. So the thing is, it's a little bit more liquidy than like average lotion. Lotion's like super thick. Um, Ooh, so it has like a little bit of thick. less thickness. It's more like thin, but it still is lotion-y. I love a thick lotion. I want my lotion thick. It makes your hands like overly soft. Like I don't think I've ever felt lotion like get your hands super soft like that. And uh, like I said, it smells so freaking good. Ryder Lynn is so good at describing what she likes about it. Like it's lotion that like makes your hand soft. I've never heard of such a thing. So if you guys can find this online again, it's Gucci Bamboo. Whether it's the perfume or just the lotion. This is what it looks like. I'm sure you guys know how to spell bamboo. I just like 100%. I mean. It's... If you guys are wondering what this is on the wall. The I wasn't, but thanks for pointing it out. What the hell is that? Duct tape residue that we have to get off. Becky had a picture of Bob Ross up here. Well, it was a poster and she was she had to put duct tape on it it was this whole thing but that picture is no longer there so now there's just duct tape residue thank Anyways, you so i went down the rabbit hole of watching planner videos almost like oh lord jesus lord jesus find grant me serenity <laughs> what oh the last thing amber lynn reed needs is a planner the last thing Amberlynn needs is to go down the planner rabbit hole. <laughs> Girl, please. Please tell me this is not what it's about to be. Oh, please, Lord. No. No. No, 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 no. I became obsessed. It was an obsession. You didn't even ask Becky. Like, it was bad. There's a- No, nobody has to ask you. We believe you. Your obsession with planners and journals is well documented. I believe you. I believe that you fell down this rabbit hole. Website called thehappyplanner.com. No, I'm not sponsored. God, I wish I was. Oh God, oh God. hashtag obsession. No. I have gotten plenty of planners from them before. I love planners and you can use planners for so many different no, things. No, no, So I'm going no. to be showing you. You're gonna, like, you're gonna do nothing with them because that's what you do with journals. You buy them and then you store them away and never use them. These planners a few weeks ago and I was hesitant on like sharing them because I, <laughs> I know how people are. Girl. People, you know, said I'm a hoarder and I judge. You're absolutely a hoarder. You you said, oh, look at all this stuff I just got rid of. First of all, you haven't gotten rid of it. It's still in your house. It's just in a pile for your friends to come look through. That's what hoarders say on the TV show Hoarders featuring Dr. Robin Zassio. Okay, so they do that. They say, ooh, well, I can't use this right now, but I'm, I'm gonna keep it because it might make a good gift for somebody later, or Dana might want this later, or Rafe might want this later, or Hannah might want this later. Girl, later might never come. And you still got all that stuff sitting there, and now you're buying planners? Aye, aye, aye. You know, I'm just gonna live my life, and I don't wanna be scared of showing you guys certain things and things that I'm passionate about. First planner I got is this one. It says throw powder around like confetti. Look how freaking cute. Sorry for the glare, but I mean, you guys pretty much get the gist. So this one is for my, it's gonna be like a daily tracker. Every day I'm gonna write what I'm grateful for. And then there's gonna be like a prompt that I do inside of it. So this is how this. Did you not just buy a similar journal <laughs> like a week ago as a part of Vlogmas 
and it was like three things to write about every day or something. Could you not just do this in a notebook? Greg looks, so I'm gonna be able to like write. You don't need that for a, a, a journal prompt. When I write what I'm grateful for, which all of them pretty much have this set up in it, hold on, where every day you can write something. Girl. Yeah, that's called a, a every day of the year. An agenda. It's it's called a plan of agenda using your words. Like where you can write stuff in so you know what you're supposed to do that day. That's how planners work. Not to like write what you're grateful for every day. So that's me where I'm gonna be writing something. I'm grateful for and you guys the pages in here are stunning. I'm gonna kinda like show you each one. Beauty begins the moment I, you decide to be yourself. Stop. Coco Chanel. Like look how cute. I mean it's cute so, but. Yeah, that's what this one is gonna be for. Then we have this one. It's black with a bunch of little cute things on it. Like literally. That's the gist. So I'm gonna be using this one. I wrote um on the side like what they're gonna be used for so I wouldn't forget since I am gonna be starting to use these January 1st. So this how many, one is- How many, how many planners did you get that you had to write notes on them so you would remember what to use them for? And how many different uses for a planner could you possibly have? I'm so concerned about the trees. I've been here with you before, Amber Led. I've been here with you before. Every day I'm gonna track what's my prominent mood or emotion for that day because I really wanna be in tune with how I feel and my body. But this is gonna be a memory diary. So people use- Use a journal. For memory diaries. Or you You're telling me you don't have all these other journals out here that you couldn't use? Well, a memory planner. You just- It's called a journal. Day. What did you do that day? It's a journal. How did you feel it's that day? It's a diary. And you just do it very quick in short form. So this is the layout for this planner. So it's going to be a lot easier to just do like diary. Oh things. God. No. Like that. So this one. No, a third one. The whole thing is the third like one rainbow and it says, get busy, babe. So this one is for YouTube scheduling videos, video ideas, so, YouTube notes, um, Instagram stuff. Since when, since when have you, since when have you planned that thoroughly for anything? What, what is there to plan about getting up and vlogging your day? That you're a vlog channel, girl. You're a weight loss channel, girl. You get up and you vlog what you're doing every day. What, what do you have to plan about that? <laughs> like, and it's not like you're out here planning trips to places. You go to the same Walmart every day. You gotta write that down in your planner so you don't forget to do it. You gotta write down which disgusting soup you're gonna make today in your planner so you don't forget. <laughs> I don't get it. Snapchat stuff, just like social media stuff in general. So no. this is my social media planner. No. This one says always choose happy. This is so cute, I love it. So this planner is about my goals. So I'm gonna be doing weekly goals. You could literally, if you are really that committed to using a planner, you could do every single one of these things in one planner. You absolutely could. I'm sure one of those planner videos you watched probably showed you how to do that. To be quite honest with you. This is ludicrous. This is wasteful. You are a hoarder. Daily goals, monthly goals, yearly goals. And I'm just going to track them in here, which I'm super excited for because there's a lot of things that I want to accomplish in the year of 2020. And honestly, I am just thoroughly excited. This one says 2020, this is your year. This one is strictly for budgeting, appointments, like bills, just everything like that. Like we are on, I think journal number five and I'm still convinced you could do all five of these things in one planner. <laughs> like, girl, you went and did all this good stuff. You went and got all this stuff for these homeless folks and you said, let me reward myself. Let me buy myself a bunch of shit I don't need. And you got, like, this is this is the disconnect, right? Like, Amber Lynn can go do these nice things and then doesn't realize, like, the disconnect is, is these people have nothing and she's giving them a small little chunk uh, of her life, <laughs> of her money. And then she goes out and buys all the stupid shit. You could have bought, like, I'm guessing a ton more food for them, a ton more socks for them, gloves. 
But no, we need five planners so that we can organize your life where you like go to the same Walmart every day, throw in the chilies, throw in. So we got chilies on Monday. We got Casa Grande on Tuesday. We got sushi on, on Wednesday. We got Chinese buffet on Thursday. <laughs> this is so dumb. This is the planner that I'm gonna be using as like a normal planner. So that's what this one's They're all normal that's planners. The most important one. This one says new year, new feels, new chances. Is this six? Dreams, fresh starts. So this one is what I'm gonna be using for my weight loss. I'm gonna be writing my grocery list in there, my weight every day, how many steps I take, meal prep. Girl, quit while you're ahead. In there, just like anything weight loss related. Do you, do you currently have a planner where you're doing all six of these things at once, do you? I mean, this is a serious question because if you don't, you've somehow managed. You have somehow managed without six. And do I think you're gonna use all of them? No, I would love to see it. Prove me wrong, Amberlynn. Prove me wrong that this isn't a wasteful, wasteful asshole of planners that you don't need. I'll be putting in that planner. So I'm gonna be using six planners and I know you guys think that's crazy. It but there is. are people who use like upwards to 20. I don't, stop comparing yourself to other people. I, maybe there are some people who use 20 planners effectively. You know what you've never done on your channel? Use more than one journal. <laughs> if that, you've just bought a lot of them. You like the idea of planning out your life. You don't actually do it. I don't know how they do that. So, among that, I already had the Happy Planner stickers. Like, I did have quite a few that I bought. Oh, Lord. In the past, just so you can stickers? make. Stickers? Your planner looks stickers? cute. But I did buy more stickers. packs. Like, quite a few. Why? It's just to make your. Um, Why? If you have that many stickers, I'm, you won't even know what all is in there. How can you effectively use that many stickers at once? You can't. I don't believe it. You, oh, and then stickers on top of that, like, go pull out your adult coloring books, girl. Like, I'll show you guys a layout that I did, and so you guys can just get, like, a better feel of what I'm I am trying to get a feel. Trying to explain. So, let me open it up. Get on with it. it. So it's very low key, but I like it. So don't judge. Girl, what so are these angles? Little stickers. And it just kind of spruces up the page a little bit more. And then I also did this one. Wow. So every week you can have like a different theme. This one I did like black, white, some <sighs> golds. So innovative. Creative Lynn. Innovative Lynn. Flies this like really coral color. So um, you could do that with any of the planners. This is so like, dumb. This one. This is I, so dumb. I'm pretty sure I did it as well. Yeah, this is my weight loss one. So I just put little quotes, change nothing, and Stupid. nothing will change. Stupid. A little water bottle. On this day, I can check off like how I'm feeling, just, uh, leave the junk food behind. She put all these stickers in here and she's gonna do nothing with it. <laughs> she's gonna do absolutely nothing with it. I cannot believe, I can actually, I can believe. Focus on you, I haven't done the next week, but that's just like an example of what you can use the stickers for. It just motivates you to keep using your plan. So I know today's video has been kind of lame, which I'm very sorry for that, but my day was just very much like up and down. It was either I was cleaning or I didn't feel good or I had anxiety because the weather, like it just was like back and forth of that. So um, I hope you guys did enjoy this vlog and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Bye, Amberlynn. Whew. All right, y'all, that was it. That was it, that was our jump back in. I love a hoarder. You know I love watching the show, Hoarders, but it does kill me slowly inside <laughs> watching people be so wasteful. I just don't understand. It's one thing if you get those and you use them, but we know, we know Sis has a history of buying. <laughs> journal she's never going to use. I can think of a video that I've made about it. I will link it somewhere below, up above, in the cards at some point in this video because I've done this before. I've been here with you. You 
You don't use these journals and you joked about how you had to get rid of so many of them once upon a time. Amberlynn, Amberlynn, do better. That's all we got time for today. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe down below and hit the bell button so you get a notification every single time I go live or I post a new video on my channel. Leave me some comments down below which of Amber Lynn's journals was your favorite. Hit the like button and follow me on all of my social media. I had so much fun today and I'll see you all next time. Bye!